You know what time it is? It's time to make a horseradish and dill crusted salmon filet. Let's go. Let's make that horseradish dill crust. First, put the horseradish in the bowl. Second, lots of fresh chopped dill. We're gonna need lots and lots and lots and lots of fresh dill. Next, one finely diced red onion. Two cloves of garlic right off the microplane so they just disappear into the crust. While we got our microplane out, let's zest a couple lemons. Now that we zested our lemon, we're gonna remove the segments. Chop off the top, chop off the bottom, come around the side, and you wanna remove all the skin to expose just the fruit. All right, just like so, perfectly peeled lemon. Then, with a small serrated paring knife, get in there, each segment one by one, and pop them out. We're gonna chop that up, and add it to our crust. All right, last, we're just gonna add some extra virgin olive oil, season this up with some kosher salt, black pepper, mix it all together, and mound it on top of our salmon fillets. Time to prepare the salmon. Lightly oil the baking sheet so the salmon doesn't stick. We're gonna season the baking sheet. Yeah, that sounds crazy. We're gonna season the baking sheet just so it seasons the salmon. We're gonna take that salmon, skin side down, move it around a little bit. Yes, the skin is on the salmon. It's healthy, eat it. Nice oil on the bottom so it doesn't stick. Always season your salmon fillets, a little bit of salt. And now we're gonna take our crust and mound it on top of our salmon before we throw it in a hot oven. We're gonna take a big heaping spoon of our horseradish still crust, and get it right on top of that salmon. We're gonna take our time, work with your hands, and want a nice even crust across the top of that fish. When it comes to putting the crust on the salmon, baby, take your time, do it right, we can do it, baby. That's right, nice and thin, even crust. Do this ahead of time, throw it in the fridge. When you're ready to cook it, just pop it in the oven. Just to have some fun and make them look pretty, we're gonna throw a nice little slice of lemon right on top of those. Look how pretty that looks. It's pretty before it even hits the oven. Let's go! We're gonna gently place this in a 500 degree convection bake oven and watch the magic happen. 12 minutes, 400 degrees. Look at these beautiful horseradish crusted dill salmon. We're gonna garnish those lemon slices with some fresh dill. We're gonna garnish it with some sea broccoli because this is a healthy dish and I'm trying to eat healthy and bring this baby on home. There we have it, horseradish dill crust salmon fillets, a little bit of olive oil at the top, but there's so much flavor in that crust, you don't need anything else. Perfectly cooked, moist and juicy in the center. Don't overcook your salmon. 